What's up, big gang? Welcome back to our channel. It's your boy Roro, and I'm back with another quick video, guys. Guys, I'm making this quick video because I'm actually cooking right now, and I'm gonna um, show you guys how to make curry chicken. Um, I wasn't gonna make a video, but I'm like, you know what? I don't think I ever show you guys how to make uh, curry chicken before. So um, we are about to go in the kitchen, and I'm gonna show you how to make some curry chicken i know i always make video um show you guys how to make jerk chicken but today we are gonna make some curry chicken okay so okay guys i'm back um so here's the drumstick and leg and ties like i said before um i already washed it with some vinegar i wasn't gonna make a video like i said before but i'm like you know what i don't remember making um a curry chicken video for you guys so I said all right why not so I'm gonna drain this water out because that's a lot of water in the pan hopefully you guys can I don't know if you can see it I would have to probably turn the camera down uh, but anyway guys I'm gonna drain the water off and then I'm gonna add my seasoning I'm gonna probably let it sit for a little bit even though um, it's best when you season your chicken from overnight and I'm just gonna do this really fast um, I'm gonna try to go as fast as possible because I realize most of my cooking video they tend to be long and I'm not trying to make a long video so I'm just gonna drain the water off real quick <clears throat> all right that's that right there and I'm gonna grab I'm gonna grab my seasoning and you guys I already know the season that we use. I'm not even gonna show you guys them again. I'm just gonna pour my season and mix it around and let it sit for a little bit. So, let's do this. as possible and that's number two put a little bit more slide it to the back and these put it right there Okay, that's that, that's done. Um, give me one second, I will be right back. I'm gonna grab some, um, I'm gonna grab some gloves so I can mix it. I mean, my fingernail is cut, but I'm gonna grab some gloves so when I'm done, I can hit the stop button or something. So give me one second. Okay, and this is the curry we are using. I don't think um, the curry that's in this is it's not the right curry in the bottle. This is actually better pot curry but you can use whatever curry you choose to use but before we add some of that I'm gonna um, mix the season up real quick okay Guys, this is how I make my curry chicken. Um, they sell a curry at Walmart as well. All right, so that's the seasonings. The seasoning is rubbed up in the chicken. I'm gonna grab my curry and I'm gonna use a little bit, just a little beanie bit, because we are and we are gonna um, end up burn some of the curry 
before we put the curry in the pot okay so we're gonna put a little bit this is like to pre-season the chicken so we're gonna put a little bit a little bit okay not too much and that should be good and then put that over there and we're gonna mix it up again I'm gonna show you guys what I mean by burning the curry So that's done. I'm gonna leave that right there and I'm gonna put one of these covered thingy over the chicken and let it sit for a little bit because curry chicken don't really take long to cook but at the same time you want to make sure your chicken is cooked all the way because you don't want to see no red in the bone when you're biting on the bone and all of that stuff. Okay so let me grab this real quick. So I'm gonna use this to cover it and let it stay for a little bit, okay? Um, so that's good right there. Also guys, let me see if I can take the camera up now. Oh my back. Also guys, I'm making, I'm making um, some gungu rice and peas. Making some gungo rice and peas. Uh, hopefully you guys can see that clear. I don't know what's going on, but um, yeah, we are making some gungo rice and peas. Okay, let me show you the gungo we actually use. This is not the real gungo that you pick off the tree and then wash it and cook it at the same time. This is the gongo we're using. This one come in the can. Come on, I hate when you do that. Or do you want me to put it right here? Take my hand out of the way, come on, come on. It's actually called green pigeon peas. Come on, why it's not working? Oh, I'm trying to get this thing to work guys, but some reason it don't want to work but this is the come on <laughs> that's crazy I don't know maybe too much stuff going on in the background anyway guys this is the gongo we use Goya green pigeon peas it's not it's not the peas that you normally pick up the tree back home in Jamaica and um, wash it and then cook it and it really tastes really 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 good okay but I'm about to stir this as well and then I'm gonna pour some of this water back on it and let it steam and then for the curry chicken I'm gonna let it sit for a couple more minutes I'm gonna play some more video game and let that sit for a couple more minutes and then I'm gonna come back and then when I come back, i show you guys all of that good stuff, okay? So, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm about to... It's been like a couple minutes now. Normally, it's best if you season up your chicken overnight. Uh, it just hold the season a little bit better. And the season soak through the chicken and all of that. But anyway, guys, I'm going to throw some cooking oil in the pot I'm gonna to try to do this with one hand so I'm gonna pour some cooking oil in the pot I'm not gonna to put too much I think that's good because I don't want it to be too greasy I want the gravy to look nice and not too much cooking oil Alright, so the cooking oil is in the pot, um, I turn down the stove a little bit. What I normally, what, what I like to do is, I don't want the oil to be too hot, because anyway, you take it, the curry is still going to be burned. Okay, but I'm going to grab the curry real quick. So, 
So I'm gonna grab the curry real quick and then I'm gonna pour some in the pot. Um, you don't have to really use a lot, like a lot, lot. And that's how you burn curry. Um, I think that should be good. And then you just story the rest in the oil. And this is how you burn your curry. Some people burn it, some people don't burn it. It's whatever, whatever you decide to do, whatever make you happy. You do whatever you want to make you happy. So the curry is burned. I'm, I'm gonna turn the stove down a little bit more because I don't want it to burn, burn all the way till it turn black. I'm running from that, I don't like that. Then I would have to start all over but wash the pot out and start all, all over back again. So I'm gonna grab my chicken now. Um, actually, you know what, I'm gonna stop this video real quick guys because I'm gonna wash my right hand and I'm gonna grab my chicken and then put the chicken inside the pot. So give me one second. Okay guys, I'm back again. I'm gonna uh, put my chicken inside the the pot so we do this I'm trying to show you step by step and you just put it in there and you can cut it up whatever size you like the chicken when you cut up chicken you can cut it up whatever size you like doesn't matter And like I said guys, you can buy the curry at Walmart. It doesn't have to be better pot curry. You can buy the curry at Walmart. So while that's in the pot right now, I'm gonna go ahead and rinse my pot, well, my pan out with some water and then pour it inside the pot and then let that simmer for a little bit before we start add like carrots and stuff, onion, you know all of that good stuff. I'm washing my hand real quick. Oh. <laughs> I'm trying to do this with one hand guys, okay? So bear with me. But you don't want you don't have to put a lot of water because the curry when you're making curry you tend to make a lot of water in the pot also. Alright, so now that's good right there. There. Now I'm going to turn the fire back up and put the cover on it and we're going to let that do its thing and um, when the color change I'm going to come back and show you guys all that good stuff and I'm only going to use some carrots that I got right here, um, onion and bell pepper. I might put one potato in it. Wifey says she don't really like potato in curry chicken. I don't know why, but she says something about the potato make the curry look grainy or some shit like that. So I might use one potato. If not, I just use the carrot, um, the onion, scallion, and the bell pepper and that's it. So I'll be right back guys. Okay guys, I'm back again. So once you burn the curry and all of that good stuff and you put the chicken in the pot, um, it should look like this, okay? I don't know if you guys can see it clear on your end, but you should, all the chicken should have the color of the curry. So meanwhile it's cooking, you can use a fork or a spoon and you just keep on Storing, storing, storing the pot until all the chicken look like the curry. So if you have chicken on the top, you should store it and let the chicken on top go to the bottom. Okay. Um, also, that's it. That's how it look. Also, guys, um, for my rice, I didn't bother pour none of this water on my rice because the rice was already finished. Um, 
I might make a video maybe next time or maybe if wifey wanna make if wifey wanna cook some gungo rice and peas and next time I might make a video how to make gungo rice and peas <clears throat> but for now that's how the rice and peas look and that's done um, like I said I wasn't gonna make a video but I'm like you know what I don't remember making a video of me making curry chicken so I end up cooking the rice before the chicken and this is all my seasoning over here let me cover that so no further away this is all my season this is what I'm gonna go inside the curry and that's about it um, I didn't bother to use no potato so this is um, the carrot uh, scallion green bell pepper and some onion and thyme I'm gonna wait for the chicken to cook some more actually I'm gonna wait yeah I'm gonna wait for the chicken to cook some more then I'm gonna add this season to the chicken um, I'm not gonna make another video guys I'm just gonna insert a picture when the food is done because I'm not trying to make a long video also guys I want your help wifey cut these off the carrot the top of the carrot and they are growing but I'm 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 thinking in the back of my mind I don't think if you plant this you can get carrots so um, you guys can leave some comment down below and let me know if you plant it if we are gonna get carrot or you think we should just throw it in the garbage because my thing my thing was I was thinking maybe you actually need to buy maybe the carrot seed from Lowe's or Home Depot and then plant it and then that's how you get carrot but I don't think you can get carrot from this I mean it's actually growing but I don't think you can get carrot from that I know this over here you definitely can get pineapple from that but leave some comment down below and let me know if you can actually get carrot from this okay um, I will insert the picture of the dinner when it's ready um, that should be the final part of the video when I insert the picture of the dinner inside the video okay if that makes sense and as you can hear it's making a lot of water but anyway guys don't forget to like share comment and subscribe okay peace I'm out okay guys I know I said I was gonna I wasn't gonna make no more video but I just want you guys to get it right if you're making curry chicken so I can so oh Roro -ro didn't show how you um, show you how to make the curry chicken good so I add my season and this is how it should look look at that color it's looking beautiful that's how it should look okay if you don't have that color you can always add a little bit more curry in the pot even though it's not burned and then you just let it cook from there okay um, I won't show you guys the finished product still I'm just gonna take a picture and insert it in the video I'm actually using my phone right now I don't know what's going on with that camera and um, for the gongo rice and peas this is the gongo rice and peas we use okay you see what this is much much better and clear I don't know what's going on with that camera but um yeah guys that's about it so don't forget to like share comment and subscribe okay peace I'm out